I'm at the stage where I'm almost can't cope. This location was very popular with my last video. Welcome back to another video folks, I'm Samantha Coughlin and this is an abandoned farmhouse outside Letterkenny. Um, we have uh, seen this uh, property before but a couple of months down the line my editing has got better, I'll give you a better look at, at things, um, give you a better video, give you better content. So let's get started folks. I'm currently in a front room which looks like a sitting room. Now this place is pretty smashed up. But as you've seen in the intro, there is a lot of, uh, there's a lot of buildings to this property. Going into another front room. into the kitchen area and an old stove uh, wooden wall partitions in, in most of it apart from this hallway, this, this, this wall here uh, but maybe they were one room at one time and uh, they were uh, divided up which looks like that's what happened but uh, pretty smashed up but as you've seen at the beginning lots and lots of buildings to uh, to look around there's an area where possibly a television was going into what was the kitchen Very narrow. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. I couldn't be arsed going down, down to the right. Though. Going into a back porch. And that gives you an idea of how dangerous it is upstairs. The floorboards are rotten. Um, this is an extension. This is an extension off the back and upstairs right above us is a bathroom which I'm not going to walk into but I'll show you. The storage area under the stairs. These stairs doesn't look they don't look too bad. My fam famous last words before I fall to my death. Oh no, this does not look good. Right, we have to try carefully here. A uh, be bedroom. And it's uh, partitioned as well. But as you can see there, the floors are pretty, pretty sketchy here. Right, I'm going to quickly go through 
the top floor of this because this floor is very sketchy and I just want to get back downstairs again into another bedroom minding where I am putting my feet another bedroom so. the wall's pretty smashed up there into another bedroom if I fall through this floor I hope the carpet holds me up because this it does feel a bit spongy Right, across the landing into another bedroom. Guys, I don't know the history to this house. Um, I don't know if it's haunted. I don't, uh, and I just do not know anything about it. Sometimes I pick up stuff on camera that I fail to see myself. So keep your eyes and ears uh, out. Uh, I will go through the footage with a pair of headphones and see will I pick up anything on uh, on uh, the camera's audio. But sometimes I do. Uh, a lot of nails sticking up out of wood. So I have to be very, very careful here. The old fashioned beds and a fireplace in each room. Here's the bathroom with no roof on it and uh, trees growing in it and there's a bath. Uh, the toilet seems to have been over here, sink over there. Uh, that tree is not original to this room, obviously. But uh, you can see the way nature is starting to take over this place again. Back down the stairs without falling and killing myself. But I have to uh, watch out for uh, wood with nails through it. Pretty dangerous inside here. We weren't in this uh, area the last time. Um, I found it hard to get in, so uh, uh, the door's open this time. So, folks, uh, let's have a look. Um, that is why sometimes it's be uh, it is a good idea to come back a second time. It is a big, huge garage with double doors. It looked like it might have been a business of some kind a way back. But uh, stuff being burnt in here as well, folks. Every abandoned explorer I've gone to, people have tried to burn it, which is a shame. On the property as well, we've got this massive warehouse. This place is huge. It's paint. Oh, that's okay. My camera's not focusing properly and it's struggled for light. There we go. But, but uh, as you can see, a massive building here.
Let's go into some of the other outbuildings. Another area which looks like a cow shed of some kind. Full of old furniture. Right, let's go to another building, folks. I've been filming all day to try and catch up with my work, and that, uh, and it's blistering hot, and I'm at the stage where I'm almost can't cope. After this one, I am done for the day. This area. It still has the cordoned off tape on it because somebody did put it on fire as you can see there into another area and steps up to an area that had been burnt Loads and loads of brand new slates. This location was very popular with my last video, so that is another reason why I decided to come back because I've learned how to edit since and I can uh, present a better uh, video for you guys. So, hope you're enjoying it. up to very old barns with more nettles and I just got stung again not looking for sympathy just making a point as I said before but uh, obviously an area for holding cows No water tank. Let's go to the last building, folks. Um, I can't wait till I finish this because I have run out of water and I have to go and get some. Shop shelving and doors. Ah, she didn't go in here the last time. Oh, stone effect tiles. There's crates of them there. That's what they are. Crafted stone effect. And they would have been pretty expensive too, like. And some shelving. Folks, hope you enjoyed the video. I will see you in the next one. And as always, be good to each other.